Welcome to the channel where we talk about supply chain management and planning. Today's video is on backflushing. It's a method used in manufacturing and inventory management that streamlines the process of accounting for parts and materials after the completion of production, rather than before or during the production process. Think of it as planting a garden, but only counting the seeds that sprouted into plants, rather than every seed you planted. In traditional inventory systems, materials are logged and deducted from inventory as they are issued to production. This can be compared to checking off each ingredient as you add it to a recipe. However, in a high-paced manufacturing environment, especially one that employs just-in-time manufacturing principles aimed at reducing waste and enhancing efficiency, stopping to count every nut and bolt can slow things down. Backflushing automates this process. Once a finished product is manufactured, the system automatically deducts the required materials for that product from inventory, based on the standard bill of materials, BOM, for that product. It's like cooking a meal, and instead of noting each ingredient as you use it, you simply deduct everything you know the recipe needed once the meal is made. The advantages of backflushing include streamlined operations, reduced paperwork, and less manual labor involved in tracking inventory. This makes it ideal for environments with consistent production processes and where the cost of individual components is relatively low compared to the cost of stopping the production line. However, it requires accurate production records and reliable standard operating procedures to ensure inventory accuracy.